Laker fans. And it's not all of you. It's not all of you. There's a lot of regular Laker fans out there, and I'm not talking to y'all. Y'all just had hope and belief in y'all team, especially because y'all have LeBron and AD, and y'all had realistic expectations knowing that y'all weren't the better team, but y'all still had a chance. So we're not talking about you. Y'all delusionals, though. The delusional Laker fans that just straight up thought that, you know, y'all were better, that y'all had all the pieces to beat this team, even though y'all showed no proof of doing so in the past year. Um, and my point that every time, even though it's a close game, they know how to win in the clutch when it matters the most. Y'all don't. But hey, what do I know, right? What do I know? <laughs> what do I know? So, I... Is reality setting in for y'all? Because... I, um, I hope reality setting in for y'all. Y'all, y'all know y'all going home, right? And honestly, they're sweeping y'all again. And I hate to say it because this ain't got nothing to do with the team for real. Or at least not Braun and AD. Braun and AD, you can't say nothing about them two the whole series. Everybody else? D-Lo? <laughs> Everybody else? Yeah, man. And this is a, this is another point I was making about consistency. Well, let's get this thing started. What's good, y'all? It's your boy, Leek. A.K.A. Malik. Back here with another video. I think, I think, you know, I even brought out my custom LeBron jersey for in spirit of this video. I don't even know if I'm going to put it on. Well, you know, it's in spirit for y'all. Because I know y'all going through a hard time. Some of y'all hate this team because y'all can't beat them. But, like, the I'll be watching, like, I don't know if any of y'all be paying attention to, like, the Lakers press conferences. or I mean, not Lakers, the Nuggets press conferences and stuff. But the only, the only member of the Lakers that, I mean, the Nuggets that I've ever seen talk shit about the Lakers is Mike Malone. Everybody else has the most humblest shit to say. I just watched MPJ say, he was like, man, like, about the, in his press conference, they asked him about, like, does it feel good that you guys beat the Lakers 11 times in a row? And he was like, it just feels good to win games because every game is hard to beat them in general. It's like hard to climb back and hard to do this. So like we just appreciate just getting the win at the end of the day. So like speaking of that sniper, that boy was going off. I turned this game on for a little bit, but like I was like looking in and out because I was playing. My, I was also playing the game, so like I was like. Yeah, I was like, I, I ain't gonna lie, I kind of forgot my train of thought. That, that ad kind of, you know. Oh yeah, I wasn't even, yeah, I was playing the game, so I was like looking in and out of like, looking at the game, and plus the NFL draft is on. So I can see what my cars did. Shout out to my cars, because we got my receiver. Welcome to, welcome to the cars, Marvin Harrison. We gon' you gon' you gon' you gon' love it here, man. I promise. We gon' do you right. We gon' do you right, my man. But yeah, man, I'm watching this game. And like y'all had a good lead. Y'all had like every every damn game. Y'all had a double digit lead. So I'm like, I'm thinking like, okay, maybe if y'all keep the momentum up, y'all can maybe win the game. But I'm like. Because I was, as soon as I thought that, I was like, no way, no way, I saw this, like, I don't know, man, the Nuggets is just a really good basketball team, when it comes to consistency, when it comes to knocking down shots, they do it, they got the, they got the people that do it more, I promise you, Eddie J was on my fantasy, he rarely had bad games on my fantasy, rarely, Reeves had a head of steam, gets cut off, contact. Man, you got baby, man. You got baby, man. Get up. 
But yeah, man, it's over. I, I will get the broom, but my broom's kind of dirty, and I don't feel like bringing it in here. So I'll bring the broom tomorrow. Get y'all, get y'all my gift like last year how I did. You know, if you if you know, you know. Cause y'all, the Lakers is definitely getting swept, and I I hate it for Bron, man, and AD, man. Bron and AD have literally been playing the hardest. Brian, Brian is literally too old. He definitely traveled. <laughs> Brian is too old to really carry a team by himself anymore. And then, like the role players is just the role players is literally the biggest problem. And D'Lo, and D'Lo, D'Lo was ass. He didn't make a buggy. We, we all did the same thing as Nilo that day. Except we had to run up and down the court for 25 minutes. We all did the same thing as Nilo, man. Ain't that, ain't that something. And like, I just, I, like, and like, the only reason why I was just so, like, against the Lakers winning this series, because I wasn't even, I wasn't even crazy against them winning the series until the delusional Lakers fans, oh my god, Aaron Gordon is sleeping, until the delusional fans was talking crazy, was literally, literally because all year, all year, Y'all been up and down. Y'all been up and down all year. Up and down about D-Lo. There was a, there was literally a good point of the year. Y'all wanted to trade him, and then once those trading talks came out, and he started to lose. They're like, okay, I guess he's good. Um, throughout the regular season, I ain't hear shit good about Gabe Vincent unless he. The only things I would ever hear unless he, he was hurt or just bad shit. I never hear. Oh my God. Casey, where the fuck is he going? Jumper goes ah, where you going? Yeah, Austin was He came out so aggressive. Literally, a, ooh, literally, a, raises the rim. Literally, D'Lo could have just did what he was supposed to do, up. man. They are Lakers could have won this game. Anytime the Lakers blow the, anytime the Lakers blow the lead against the team, you should already know it's over. I like once, literally once it was close, once it was like a three point game, I was like, oh, they lost, they lost. Same thought I had when, same thought I had when they were up twenty, honestly. Shout out to FPJ! FPJ has really became one of my favorite players in the league, no cap. Him and my twin there. Him and my twin there. I, 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 just, like the, I just like the Nuggets, I ain't gonna lie. Oh yeah. The die. I, I didn't understand what, what the... Like, you got the best passer damn near on the court. Between him and Braun, the best passes on the court probably. You can really argue Jokic is the better passer. Um, and you go to double Jokic like he's not going to find the open man. When I saw that, I was just like, yeah, y'all just lost, bro. I don't know what y'all doing, but y'all lost. That's y'all mans. That's y'all mans. That's y'all mans, Laker fans. Dave Vincent, shout out to AD. Like you can't even, there's like nothing to say. Good spin. Good spin and seal. Denver's lead is four. Murray bounce it again and again. Yeah, and like again. like it's Aaron Gordon is just beasting this game. Three minutes to go in the third. Porter so is FPJ. Oh, I thought he was making that. Rebound, flips it up and in, plus one. Taps the ball to himself. He's now in double figures and boards. This is crazy, man. Laker fans, y'all gotta. Yeah, I know y'all hurting right now, man. Y'all about to get swept back to back. And I ain't gonna lie. I do want to see LeBron get at least one more. But like, time's a ticket. I really think he's only gonna play Max like two more years. I really think he's gonna play Max two more years. Obviously, he has like more left than that. But I think he. Oh my God! Is that a three? That was a three. He's nasty for that. Seven to shoot. Porter squares and hits. 
and PJ. We know he is streaky. The Lakers have lost 10 straight to the Nuggets. LeBron James, a part of nine of those. What are y'all doing? Communications bad. Waves of defenders. He misses on the fadeaway. Three rebound. Oh, you make that? Okay, okay, Prince. Yogi was devastated when he made that shit. And DJ, that little nigga can't guard me. You know I shoot over him. Is the truth right there? Difficult shot. Russell and Reeves are a combined four of eighteen from the field. Four of eighteen between Russell and Reeves. And all four is from Russell. I mean, from Reeves. Rotate over. Coldwell Pope hits the cutter. I kind of, I like, I want to feel bad for y'all. I feel bit well, like, want to feel bad for y'all, but you know, they, I told y'all, they're the, they're just the better team. What it matters most is the most consistent team. Y'all didn't think I knew MBJ could do shit like this. Y'all didn't know I knew MBJ could have games like this. I pick him back to back on my fantasy every year for a reason, man. I know what this is like. He's nice. And he just tossed it right to At one point, and he might, he might even still be leading it. Like at one point during the year, he was leading in wide open three point shots, like percentage. Like you literally couldn't leave him wide open. Camp San Diego. And of course, with this team, he's gonna get wide open because he's not even the first. He ain't even the second option. I mean, he might be the second option. Last postseason. Then you got Aaron Gordon giving you 29. You got Jokic giving you 24. MPJ with a good 20. Yeah, bro. They're just a better team. are rolling. They take a 3 0 lead in the series. I want to feel bad for y'all, but I only feel bad for Ron and AD. If you're not Ron and AD, can't feel bad for it. I can't feel bad for his soul. Yeah, especially not the Laker fans. I ain't gonna lie. But that's gonna do it. Um, Hopefully we can at least get a game or we're gonna be in the same boat as y'all. But the difference between me and y'all, I didn't go. I didn't. I'm not delusional. After game one, I saw what I needed to see. I knew I knew what to expect from there on out. I wasn't wrong. Now, but I think we can I think we got a good chance of winning at home because we won at home last year against Denver, the defending champs. We can get a game, bro. We can get a game. But yeah, leave a like if you enjoy it. Comment anything you got in you say. And subscribe if you're rocking with me. You know the deal. Y'all really going home? No.